Thirteen years after she debuted in a metallic Versace dress, Elizabeth Hurley startled fans by putting it on. In low-cut costumes, the 58-year-old actress and her 22-year-old son Damien coordinated at a special screening of his feature directorial debut, Strictly Confidential, on Wednesday in New York City. And after posting pictures from the premiere to Instagram, Elizabeth disclosed that, yes, she had worn the dress 13 years before. Thankfully, it still fits. I enjoy looking through my closet for gowns I've worn in the past and cherishing those memories, then dressing them up for a big occasion that I wore this outfit to a charity event in London in 2011 and to the Strictly Confidential premiere in New York this week. It's not broken if you can still fit into it, Elizabeth remarked. The glitzy mother and son teamed up with stylist Mike Adler, who dressed the actress in a golden gown that accentuated her cleavage and her 21-year-old twin in identical black silk pants and blouse. In the comments section, admirers complimented the star on her youthful appearance and expressed their ideas, asking, how is this possible? Have you found the fountain of youth? I think you look better now. It fits better, madam, and, insane how you look even better in that outfit today. Amazing. Are you a vampire? Absurd how much more gorgeous you look in that dress today. The Robin Williams Center in Midtown Manhattan hosted a special screening of Damien's first feature film, Strictly Confidential, on Wednesday. Much fanfare has surrounded Damien's decision to direct Elizabeth in her lesbian sex scenes with her 28-year-old co-star Per Caravara. The model, however, has defended his choice to guide his mother through the more explicit scenes in the movie, claiming there was no intimacy coordinator present on set. He emphasized that although it would seem weird to ordinary people, it is commonplace for individuals who have grown up in the business as the offspring of celebrities. In an interview with the Sunday Times, he said of recording his mother's sensual sequences, I hate to say that it felt totally normal. What that says about us, I'm not sure. I was talking to a lot of my friends in the field who are second-generation parents as well. They all say the same thing, which is that although something may look very unusual and bizarre to outsiders, to us it is just something we have always known. Damien went on to say that everyone was very comfortable and that intimacy coordinators were not needed on set. He continued by saying that Elizabeth forbade him from seeing violent movies while teaching him about sex when he was ludicrously young and insisted that it is a beautiful and natural act. The mother and son's connection has previously drawn criticism, particularly after Elizabeth disclosed that Damien was the covert photographer behind her seemingly never-ending stream of Instagram swimsuit photos. She revealed the information after sharing a number of stunning holiday photos of herself in a bikini and without a bra for Valentine's Day in 2018. However, many people weren't sure how to react to her disclosure, with some calling the connection, strange. However, Damien declared that, it's business, and that he didn't see why others thought it unusual. We just think about, point, press, done, post, and nothing more. Describing their relationship in detail, he said that as he was growing up, it was only the two of them, so they were more like siblings than parent and kid. He also acknowledged that in recent years, their closeness has become even more acute and important. They are extraordinarily alike and in tune, he continued, adding that they can have complete conversations just nodding and shaking our heads due to their twin telepathy. Elizabeth, who has an ex Steve Bing and shares a son named Damien, recently told Access Hollywood that she felt safe and looked after while filming the movie. Elizabeth clarified, saying, It's comforting to know there's someone watching over you behind the camera. His writing required me to do certain things, which weren't necessarily things I'd frequently performed in movies, however, having him there made me feel secure and cared for, and I knew he would take care of me during post production. So really, working with your family is kind of liberating, she continued. I might try it one more. Damien concurred with his mother, telling the magazine that he didn't think the personal sequences were awkward and emphasized that he couldn't afford to because of the short shooting schedule. It's quite strange, we felt comfortable, he remarked. 
I believe that every second counts during the 18 days that you have to shoot an independent picture. You cannot simply ponder over scenarios and ask yourself, what if?